Welcome to the second day of our Boundary Waters trip. Much better start today than yesterday because it's not raining and the sun actually came out for a little bit. Ethan. What happened last night? Uh, well, there's this whole thing. Uh, there, there's a storm that kind of blew through. Uh, some thunder, lightning, some rain, not, not too much, but the wind was, uh, the wind was pretty intense. Seamus, how do you feel about the storm? Well, I woke up this morning and I asked Ethan, hey, some storm came through, didn't even hear it. And I slept through it. Apparently it was pretty intense. So today's plan is to get to some waterfalls and take pictures of that. I mean, I'll be taking pictures. Ethan will be fishing. And uh, we're, gonna, we're going to wait until the wind dies down just a little bit because it's kind of windy. I mean, it's already died down a little bit. And we're going to take off at 2 o'clock and it's about noon. So a few more hours of just hanging out, reading, doing whatever, enjoying nature, just getting out of that city life. Hey Ethan, where's the portage? Uh, I, I mean, we followed a trail. Yeah, backwards, yeah. So we completed our second day of canoeing. We didn't go too far. Our goal was to reach, um, what was it called? Redwood Falls. Redwood Falls, which is, Right over there, if you can't hear it. It's right over there. So Ethan, how was how was canoeing today? Uh, it, it, was, uh, it was okay. Nothing really went wrong. Well, it's kind of weird. What about that one spot where we thought there was a portage in the campsite and there was nothing? I, I thought you just wanted to hang out. I did not. 